Now I'm back, matey, with the rage of the seven seas and the bravery of many more whiskies. So come on this journey with me's. There's a feeling in me heart and a feeling in me cock. And I'm not going to take no for an answer, matey. And I don't mean that in the creepy rapist way. I mean that in the courting way, matey. Or I'm going to be a romance. And we're going to sweep this hefty lass off her feet, matey. Ahoy, oh, mateys. I'm full of whiskey and I'm feeling frisky. I've got a feeling of romance and it's in my pants. So let's take the hefty girl out for another dance. That's right, matey. We got them Lizzo grips on the bar again to make it a fat cunt, matey. To make it more challenging on the grip, matey. Or to be doubling like a form of foreplay, matey. Cause it be getting us extra prepared, matey, for when we be going them heavier on them normal overhand grips, matey. Pushing them forearms to the limits, matey. Making those cock veins burst out there, matey. To show the barmaid what we really made of, matey. You see the barmaid, matey. They be seeing them cock veins in the forearms, matey, and it be short wire in their little brains, matey, and they start to be thinking about the cock. That's right, matey. So it's a good wee psychology trick you can play on the lasses. And then they be saying, Oh, oh I love the look of your cock arms. Oh, please, stick your cock in me. Uh, yee. Why, it was just the overnight, me hearties. Me lass be saying, Oh, ye arms are looking very vascular. And I be saying, I'll show you something vascular, you fucking harlot. And then I did. And guess what I showed her? My cock. That's right, me hearties. So it works. It's proven by science. Now this cock ripping set, matey, that we be having on this picture box here, matey. I be thinking that I'd loaded up the 165 kilos, matey. And I was ready to go to hell and back, matey, to put on at least 10 repetitions there, me hearty. And afterwards I'd be realising I make a misfoculation on the on them weight addings, matey. You know, 157 and a half, me hearties. But I'd be pushing this to me cock's edge, matey. So it'd still be a good thing, matey. 17 rest pause style reps, matey. But as you see here, me hearties, I've been having some heckling from a group of local sparrows, matey. That's right, mate. They're trying to give me some shite. And I flip them off, matey, because I don't take no shite from the bird cunts, matey. And I hit them right back, matey, and I be saying, Who are ye to judge me? You got feathers on your cock, you cunt. So why don't you just shut the fuck up, you flappy little bitch? And that'll be put on the little cunts in their place, at least for a wee while, mate. And then they're bringing up their bravery again, and they come back for another heckling, matey. But it's all part of life's rich tapestry, matey. You give what you get, matey, and you get what you're given, matey. And I'll put it to ye like this, me hearty. You don't pluck the feathers from a seagull's cock, and then complain when he gnaws on your decomposing corpse, matey. If you know what I mean. But back to them deadlift anyway, me hearty. So this set I have to be putting all of me cock into it, matey, because this be a real cunt of a set, mate. And I be getting a cardio from it as well, matey. It be getting the ticker ticking, matey. And that's a good thing, matey. So there be multiple benefit, matey. And here I am, screaming to the sky, daring any seagull to come and shout on me, because I'll come and punch you in the tits, you cunt. Of course, me hearty, this all be in jest, matey, because I don't be hitting animals. But you know who do be hitting animals, mate? Is that Daddy Aioli cunt, matey. And he's an ultimate cunt, matey. Hitting a poor wee cat. I think he's a queer cunt, matey. And the fact that people be calling the cat a pussy, matey, made him angry, matey. Because he don't like pussy, matey. And that's why he's called Daddy Aioli, matey. Because he be looking like he got aioli, or mayonnaise, or some shite like that, all over him, matey. After all the men be gathering around, and having a big bukkake tsunami all over him, matey. That's right, like a tidal wave of semen on the queer cunt, matey. That's the kind of character I think he is, matey. And I'm glad he be getting dropped from his label, matey. And I hope he ends up homeless, because he's a right cunt. And if we ever cross paths, me hearties, I'll be making the cunt walk the plank. That's right, matey. And he'll be swallowed by the megalodon, the cunt. And then he be getting digested and shat out as nothing more than shark shite. So I got two drinks on the go at once, me hearties. 
got a whiskey and coke and a whiskey and whiskey. Now I'm looking very stylish, matey. Your mate, and that's one of a way that ye can be appealing to them barmaids, matey, by having a great sense of style, matey. But for the time being, me hearty, it's rose before hose. Rows before hoes will allow ye to lick their toes and rip off their cloves. And you push them to the cunting limit, matey. That's right, you keep lobbying like a mad rabid dog, matey. And you stretch that lat out at the bottom, matey, like the bar wheel be getting herself stretched out with a fist in their mind. And then if you need, mate, you grab the cocky of weights and you take a rest, matey. You hear the crows singing in the background, matey? Oh, I fucking like the sound of that. The magpie crows, mate, they got a nice sound. Now we keep fucking going, matey. That's right, mateys. Because the crows be on me side, matey. They don't be cunts like them sparrow fuckers, matey. So they be having a positive message to me to say, and you're doing a good job on them rowing, matey. And it's a great idea to hold the cocky away to in between, matey, before you get back to lobbying them lats like a mad cunt. Stretching them out like the bar will be stretching her hole, matey. And then they be saying to me, We're lucky that we're a bird that live in a tree, matey. Because down on them ground, matey, when ye be having your shirt off, matey, they be flooding everywhere, matey. Because all the barmaid be out of control when they be witnessing ye. But anyway, me hearties, time to wrap it up with a quick mental health message for ye. Good about yourself. There's nothing wrong with ye, matey. You are uniquely you. And nothing more in this cunting world is true, matey. And if your mind be gone to deep parts, matey, where you be thinking about the suicides and all of them terrible things, matey. This ain't the most PC way to put it, but I'll give ye this message, matey. You're gonna die eventually, cunt. There's no need to rush it, mate. So be a wee bit more patient.